Hey everybody, thanks so much for joining me on my latest Roblox Studio beginner tutorial that will show you how you can turn off collisions for your parts or how the collision system works if you want to have objects that basically players can see but at the same time they can go through them, they're not blocking them or they cannot collide with the same objects. Now to do that we're going to first of all add a part, let's add a block that we're going to move here right in front of the player we're going to expand it so we're going to scale it up so it's like this and like this and now if I go into the game the collisions are there I can push it to the side it stops me from going through it so the first thing we're going to do is turn off collisions for the same element so when we go into the part and we search for collision here is can collide we're going to uncheck it and in theory that would be it but it's not going to do it because let me show you why the same object just falls through the level to avoid that we're going to select again the same object we're going to place it where we want and go for this anchor this means that it's going to be anchored to the surface and once we go into the game the object is there but once we go to it it features no collisions whatsoever and we can go through it be inside of it but it won't fall through the ground there you have it pretty simple pretty easy you just need to include this setup of anchoring the object so it doesn't fall through and turning off the colliders in the property menu and you have your elements or parts without their collision that's all for this tutorial, hopefully you found it interesting, hopefully you found it useful, hopefully you found it helpful. If you did, please consider supporting me through a range of means. Check out my Patreon page, check out my channel memberships, check out my books on Amazon. All of those links are in the description below, so please give them a look. And of course, the cheapest, easiest, fastest way to support me is to subscribe to my channel and be here for my new tutorials. That's all for me, thanks again for watching. My name is Ivica, have a great day, have loads of fun in your Roblox adventures and I'll see you on my new tutorial. Until then, bye bye!